Assalamu uh, alaikum everyone. Welcome back again. So we are almost done with, with Shakespeare. We're never done with Shakespeare. But I hope that the classes we did on Shakespeare, uh, you know, help, helped you in a sense, in a way to like something, at least something about Shakespeare, his characters, his uh, women, his queens, his kings, his poetry, his sonnets. We can never do justice to Shakespeare even if we take hundreds of classes. But again, this is an introduction to English literature course, which gives you bits and pieces about important literary texts and important figures in the English uh, uh, history and English literature. Today we have a fun day. We have a talent day, just to try to see what talents you have, your ability to perform, to read, to uh, write. This is your chance to take the floor here, be on the stage, and be yourself, and communicate whatever you can uh, 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 like express in writing or in performance. Uh, uh, some of these, uh, like I told you before, you could write stuff. I know some of you can write. Or at least you can perform things, or recite, or read things from texts we already studied, or texts we uh, haven't studied, but probably mentioned in, in passing. Okay, so we start with uh, Riwa Zamli. Yeah. Tell us what you want to do in brief and go on. Yes. Hi, everyone. I want to recite a nice poem for Rafifi Ziada. It names Shades of Anger. Uh, at first, I will say the introduction that she, she said. When we were, I wrote this poem when we were doing a direct action at my university and there were Palestinian citizens and Israeli soldiers. And I'm very bit about this, so I said I will only be Palestinian. I refuse to be a settler or a soldier. So I was lying on the ground and this guy came and kicked me in the gut and he said, you deserve to be raped for you have your three children. At that time I said nothing, but then I wrote this poem for this young gentleman. اسمحوا لي أن أتكلم بلساني العربي قبل أن يحتلوا لغتي أيضا. Allow me to speak my Arab tongue before they occupy my language as well. Allow me to speak my mother tongue before they colonize her memory as well. I am, I am an Arab woman of current becoming all shades of anger. All my grandfather ever wanted to do was walk up at dawn and watch my grandmother kneel on the brain a village hidden between Yafa and Haifa. My mother, my mother was born on the over here on and they say it's no longer mine, but I will record their birth, they shook one, they're down the birth wall and return to my homeland. I am, I am an Arab woman of Khan, we count all shades of anger. And did you hear my sister screaming yesterday as she gave birth at Shukbon, the Israeli soldier looking between her legs for their next demographic threats, called her baby girl, Janine. And did you hear animals screaming behind her prison as they took this gas herself? We are returning to Palestine. I am, I am an Arab woman of Khan, we count all shades of anger, but you tell me, this woman side of me will only bring you your next tourist, bird wearing, gun waving, towel, sand nigger, towel head. You tell me I send my children out to die, but those are your captors, your F 16 in our skies. And let's talk about this tourism for a second. Wasn't it the CIA that killed the Andy Alamomba? And who tried Osama in the first place? My grandparents didn't run around like a clown with white caps and white coat and their heads lynching the black people. I am, I am an Arab woman of current becoming all shades of anger. So, who tried to brown around screaming in a, in a demonstration? Sorry, did I not scream? I forget to be a villain tell us to dream. Jane in a battle, belly dancer, soft spoken. Arab woman? Yes, master. No, master. Thank you for the being at better sanitation and down rest of your of skills, master. Yes, my liberators are here to call my children and call them collateral damage. I am, I am an Arab woman of kind who come all shades of anger. So let me just tell you, so let me just tell you this, this woman side of me will only bring to her next trouble. She will have a rock in one hand and the Palestinian flag in the other. I am an Arab woman of kind. Beware, beware my anger. Thank you. This is really beautiful. Uh, you should all uh, uh, YouTube, Google Rafif Ziada. This is a really nice reading of one of her poems. But probably, I'm, I'm sure you were under the pressure of time. Hopefully, you, when you slow down, words can uh, be uttered uh, uh, clearer. But really interesting. I love how you, uh, you know, reveal the passions and the emotions 
of Rafif herself. Next. Uh, I want to read the. Uh, okay. uh, I want to read the Shakespeare's poem, uh, "All the World Stage." Okay. All the world stage, and all the men and women merely players. They have their exits and their entrances, and one man in his time plays many parts. His acts being seven ages. At first, the infant, mewling and puking in the nurse's arm, and then the whining schoolboy with his catchful and shining morning face. Creeping like snail and willing to school. Uh, creeping like a snail and willing to school. And then the lover. Signing like furnace with a woeful pallet missed to his mistress's eyebrow. Then the soldier, full of strange oath and pitted like the poet, jealous in honor, sudden and quick in quarrel, seeking the bubble revolution even, even in the cannon's mouth. And then the justice in fair round pillar with cape on line, with eyes severe and feared of formal cut, full of white souls and modern instances. And so he plays his part. The sixth age shifts into the lean and into the lean and slippered pantaloon, with spectacle and nose and porch on side. His youthful host will save a world too wide for his trunk chunk and his big manly voice, turning again toward childish triple Pipes and whistles in his sound. Last scene of all that in this strange eventful history, in second, is second childish and mere obliv oblivion. Sans teeth, sans eyes, sans taste, sans everything. We're going to we're going to act uh, a Shakespearean poem about Shylock and uh, Antonio. Okay. Make sure to look at the camera. I am sure if I forfeit, that will not take my flesh. What's that good for? To pet fish with all. If it will feed nothing else, it will feed my revenge. You have disgusted me and hindered me. Half a million laughed at my losses, scored my nation, called my friends, hated my enemies. What's your reason? I'm a Jew. Have not Jew eyes, have not Jew hands, organs, dimensions, senses, affections, passions, fed with the same food, hurt with the same disease, hurt with the same weapons, subject to the same diseases, and healed by the same means. Cooled and worn by the same winter and summer as a Christian is. <clears throat> if you prick us, do we not plead? If you tickle us, do we not laugh? And if you poison us, do we not die? And if you wrong us, shall we not revenge? If a Jew wrong a Christian, what is humanity? Revenge. But if a Christian wrong a Jew, what should his offenses be by a Christian example? I revenge. The villainy you teach me, I will execute in the child of her. I will give her the instruction. Shylock, how do you want a pound of Antonio's flesh? I will not only lose the forfeiture, but touch human gentleness and love, so please forgive Antonio. No, sir, this is our agreement. His flesh is mine, and I will have it. Okay, take the pound of flesh, but in the cutting, just, uh, just one a drop on a Christian uh, blood. Thy lands and gods are by the state. Okay, give my money and let me go. No, one half, one half goes for Antonio, the other half for the state. What mercy can you render him, Antonio? I just want him to become a Christian. So you should do this. I lost everything. My daughter, my wealth, and the most important thing, my religion. Just a little bit of passion to love the text you you doing this, and to listen to it carefully. Very good, excellent, really. Thank you. Next, come here. What's your name? Hint. Let's see what Hint has for us. Hello, everyone. Can you speak up? 
Hello everyone. I want to I want to read a poem about the greatest uh, the greatest pain in life. The greatest pain in life is not to, is not to die, but to but to be ignored, to lose the person you love so much to another who does not care at all. The greatest pain in life is not to die, but to be forgotten, to never get a call from a friend just saying hi. When you show someone your enormous thoughts and they laugh in your face, for a friend to, to always be too busy to console you when you, when you need someone to lift your spirits, when it seems like the only person who cares about you is you. Life is full of life is full of veins, but does it ever get better? Each of us has a part to play in this great play we call life. Each of us has a duty to mankind to tell our friends we love them. If you don't care about your friends, you will not to uh, we, you will not to be punished. You will simply be be ignored, forgetting as you have done to others. And finally, I want to say you, uh, to, all, if, uh, to all of you one something. If someone, if some, if someone, ser ser if someone seriously wants to be a part, go on, a part of you. Bismillah, go on. Uh, I want uh, read, uh, to Tashira um, by Samza. التأشيرة أسبح أسبح باسمك الله وليس سواك أخشاه وأحلم وأحلم أن لي قدرا سألقاه سألقاه وقد علمت في صغري بأن عروبتي شرفي وناصيتي وعنواني وكنا وكنا في مدارسنا نردد بعض الحال نغني بيننا مثلا بلاد الحب أوطاني بلاد العرب أوطاني وكل العرب إخواني وكنا, وكنا نرسم العربية ممشوقا بحامته له صدرا يصد الريح استعوي مهضا في عباءته وكنا أحد أطفال نحب كنا مشاعرنا ونفرح بالحكايات التي تروي برسلتنا وأن بلادنا تمتد من أقصى إلى أقصى وأن حروبنا كانت لأجل المسجد الأقصى وأن عدونا صهيون شيطان له ذيل وأن ليوش أمتنا لها فعل كما السيل سأبحر عندما أكبر سأبحر عندما أكبر أمر بشاطئ البحرين في ليبيا وأجني التمر من بغداد في سوريا وأعبر من موريتانيا إلى السودان وأسافر عبر مقدش إلى لبنان وكنت, وكنت أخبئ الأشعار في صدري ووجداني بلاد العرب أوطاني وكل العرب إخواني وحين كبرت وحين كبرت لم أحصل على تأشيرة للبحر لم أبحر وأوقفني جواز غير مختوم على الشباك لم أعبر حين كبرت لم أبحر ولم أعبر كبرت أنا كبرت أنا وهذا الطفل لم يكبر تقاتلنا طفولتنا وأفكار وأفكار تعلمنا مبادئها على يد قوم أيا حكام أمتنا ألستم؟ ألستم من نشأنا في مدارسكم؟ تعلمنا مناهجكم؟ ألستم من تعلمنا على يدكم بأن الثعلب المقار منتظر سيأكل معجة الحمقى إذا للنوم ما خلج؟ ألستم من تعلمنا على يدكم بأن العود محمي بحزمته ضعيف حين ينفرد؟ لماذا؟ لماذا الفرقة الحمقاء تحكمنا؟ ألستم من تعلمنا على يدكم أن اعتصموا بحبل الله واتحدوا؟ لماذا تحجبون الشمس للأعلام؟ تقاسمتم عروبتنا تقاسمتم عروبتنا ودخلا بينكم سرنا كما الأنعام سيبقى الطفل في صدري يعاديكم يقاضيكم تشتغن على يدكم فتبت كل أيديكم أنا العربي لا أخجل ولدت بتونس الخضراء من أصل عماني وعمري زاد عن ألف وأمي لم تزل تحبل أنا المصري في بغداد لنخل وفي السودان شرياني أنا مصري موريتانيا وجيبوتي وعماني مسيحي وسني وشيعي وكردي ودرزي وعلوي أنا لا أحفظ الأسماء والحكام استرحل سئمنا سئمنا من تشتتنا وكل الناس تتكسل ملأتهم 
ملأتم فكرنا تزويرا وتأليفا ها حبل الله يجمعنا وتبعدنا يد الفيفا هجرنا ديننا عمدا هجرنا ديننا عمدا فعدنا الأوس والخزرج نولي جهلنا فينا وما انتظر الغباء مخرج سيبقى الطفل في صدري يعادي يعاديكم ويعلن شعبنا العربي متحدا فلا السودان منقسم ولا الجولان محتل ولا لبنان منكسر يداوي الجرح منفردا سيجمع لؤلؤات خليجنا العربي في السودان يوزع هافة بتحبها في المغرب العربي قمحا يعثرون الناس زيتا في فلسطين الأبية سيخرج سيخرج من عباءتكم رعاها الله للجمهور متقدا سيشعل من جزائرنا مشاعل ما لها وهن إذا صنعاء تشكونا فكل بلادنا يمن سيخرج من عباءتكم رعاها الله للجمهور متقدا هو الجمهور لا أنتم هو الحكام لا أنتم ولا أخشى لكم أحدا هو, هو الإسلام لا أنتم فكفوا فكفوا عن تجارتكم وإلا صار مرتدا وخافوا وخافوا إن هذا الشعب حمال وإن النوق إن سرمت فلن تجدوا لها لبنا ولن تجدوا لها ولدا أنا باقي أنا باقي وشرعي في الهوى باقي سقينا سقينا الذل أوعية سقينا الجحل أدعية مللنا مللنا السقي والساقي سنبقى رغم فتنتكم فهذا الشعب موصول وحباؤكم وإن ضعفت فحبل الله مفتول سأكبر, سأكبر تاركا للطفل فرشاتي وألواني ويبقى يرسم العربية ممشوخا بهامته ويبقى صوت أنحاء بلاد العرب أوطاني وكل العرب Again, this is a beautiful recitation of one of the most famous poems of uh, today, Hisham al-Jaq, really interesting. I also invite you to uh, listen to other poets like uh, Tamim al-Barghouti, a wonderful yes. Palestinian poet. Uh, when, when, when you ask me whether you can do things in Arabic, I said yes, because if you love literature in one language, you love literature in all languages. Yes. And this is a fact. If your Arabic is good, you will be good at English. If you want to improve your English, you need to improve your Arabic because hopefully you will be a translator or, or a writer in the future. Really interesting. Next. Fairuz, you want to sing for Fairuz? Fairuz. Oh, your name is Fairuz. <laughs> yes. uh, hello, everyone. Can you come here? Yeah, go. Uh, hello, everyone. I want to say some lines from uh, a poem of the poet Izamim al Barghut in Arabic language. Oh, yeah. uh, مررنا على دار الحبيب فردنا عن الدار قانون الأعادي وسورها فقلت لنفسي ربما هي نعمة فماذا ترى في القدس حين تزورها ترى كل ما لا تستطيع احتماله إذا ما بدت من جانب الدرب دورها وما كل نفس حين تلقى حبيبها تسر ولا كل الغياب يضيرها فإن سرها قبل الفراق لقاءه فليست بمأمون عليها سرورها متى تبصر القدس العتيقة مرة فسوف تراها العين حين تديرها في القدس بائع خدرة من شارجع برم بزوجته يفكر في قضاء إجازة أو في طلاء البيت في القدس تورات وكهل جاء من مناهاتنا العليا يفقه فتية البولون في أحكامه في القدس شرطي من الأحباش يغلق شارعا في السوق رشاش على مستوطن لم يبلغ العشرين قبعة تحيي حائط المبكى وسياح من الإفرنج شكر لا يرون القدس إطلاقا تراهم يأخذون لبعضهم صورا مع امرأة تبيع الفجل في الساحات طول اليوم في القدس دب الجند منتعلين فوق الغين في القدس صلينا على الإسفلت في القدس من في القدس إلا أنت وتلفت, وتلفت التاريخ لي متبسما أظن أنت حقا أن عينك سوف تخطئهم وتبصر غيرهم هاوم أمامك متن نص أنت حاشية عليهم وهامش أحسبت أن زيارة ستزيح عن وجه المدينة يا بني حجاب واقعها السمير لكي ترى فيها هواء في القدس كل فتى سواك وهي الغزالة في المدى حكم الزمان ببينها ما, سل... ما زلت تركض خلفها مذ ودعتك بعينها فارفق بنفسك ساعة 
إني أراك وهنت في القدس من في القدس إلا أنت Oh, Tamim, Tamim, Tamim. Uh, if you, if you, I'm not sure if you know this, but uh, his poetry collection was translated into English. Mm -hmm. So you could also read the English translation of Al-Quds, one of the best poems uh, of uh, uh, modern or contemporary Palestinian uh, uh, literature. More? Saba? OK. Um, Idim Sabayo, Hanguko Jacob Halsu Isayo. Hello, everyone. My name is Saba. How are you? Uh, I can speak a little Korean language and I improve my language. Uh, and I want to write your name. And your name have two options to write in the okay. Korean language. Okay. Go on. 